vaping should have been there, but because of a change of word, the ends or the, the electronic cigarettes are not included. And we need to address this because vaping has become a huge epidemic in Trinidad and Tobago. When we're allowing advertising of vaping to our teens as something to do and a way to quit smoking, when it's really a way to hook them onto smoking and other drug use. Chairman of the Trinidad and Tobago Cancer Society, Dr. Asante LeBlanc, says the present format of the legislation needs to be changed. I have patients who are waiting years, years for a mammogram, years for a colonoscopy. It's not right. We need to do better. The chairman of the Cancer Society says the weight stems from the failure of equipment at all the regional health authorities across the country. There's always a shortage of breast cancer drugs, for example, um, prostate cancer drugs as well. Um, so what happens is, and when I speak to the oncologist in St. James, for example, what they're complaining to, complaining to me about is that we, while we have approved the newer drugs for treatment they're, and they're on formulary, they're still not available. So then we're giving antiquated drugs, if at all, to the patient. Dr. LeBlanc was addressing the members of the Joint Select Committee on Social Services and Public Administration on Wednesday. Terri-Anne Brown-Campbell, TTT News.